story to tell. More than 50 years after Concord flew in the sky for the first time, a brand new supersonic jet was planned to be ready to take off. After many delays, Boom Technology, a startup company based in Denver, USA, rolled out the experimental XB-1 Baby Boom aircraft on October 7, 2020. The maiden flight is scheduled for 2021. If the tests are successfully completed, the development company will design a new supersonic passenger plane. Boom Technology, also known as Boom Supersonic, was founded in 2014. The company's goal is to develop and test a technology demonstration aircraft on the basis of proven solutions. If all goes well, commercial supersonic flights will officially be revived. The XB-1 experimental aircraft was announced in the fall of 2016, nicknamed the Baby Boom. The prototype is one-third the size of the future Boom Overture supersonic transport plane. Due to delays at various stages, the maiden flight is delayed into 2018, then into 2019, and now 2021. The move is seen as paving the way for the first commercial supersonic flights. Since the legendary Concorde Triangle Wing passenger plane made its last flight in 2003, XB-1 is an important milestone towards the development of our commercial airliner, Overture, making sustainable supersonic fly mainstream and fostering human connection said Blake Shaw, Boom founder and CEO. The published images of the XP-1 show that the aircraft has a similar design to a regular passenger plane with all its characteristic features, from contours to structural elements. According to the manufacturer, the aircraft uses a variety of materials typical of modern aircraft construction. The power set is made of aluminum alloys and titanium. The carbon composite airframe maintains its strength and rigidity, even under high temperatures and stresses of supersonic flight. It has a two-crew cockpit, joined for a body and square trailing edges. For thermal control, the environmental control system uses the fuel as a heat sink to damp the cabin heat. The experimental plane has a length of 21 meters, a wingspan of 5.2 meters, and a maximum takeoff weight of 6.1 tons. It is expected that the XB-1 Overture commercial aircraft will have 55 to 75 seats, equivalent to the business class of a conventional civil aircraft. The XB-1 Baby Boom is powered by three non-afterburning J8515 engines with variable geometry inlets and exhaust. The prototype should be able to sustain Mark 2.2 with more than 1,900 km of range. Thanks to its superior speed, the XB-1 promises to cut the journey time by half. Currently, Boom has launched attractive ads for New York to London route with travel time of 3 hours and 15 minutes and ticket price is only 2,000 pounds, about 2,500 USD.
according to Fly Global, Boom is outfitting XB1 with a forward-looking vision system consisting of a high-resolution camera, which will have pilots better see outside the aircraft, particularly during landing. Such a system accommodates for the just nose high landing approach, which can obscure views outside the cockpit. In 2021, as XB1 fly test commercial, Boom intends to begin overture wind tunnel tests, and in 2022, it plans to begin construction of an overture manufacturing facility. Boom aims to unveil the first overture in 2025 and to achieve TAF certification by 2029, executive say. The planned overture production site will have capacity to produce 5 to 10 jets monthly. Boom has said it will price overture at $200 million, excluding options and interior. My video of Boom XP-1 aircraft ends here. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos.